Sergeant First Class Jason Jackson was a part of the National Guard. He was in school studying to be a doctor when he was found shot in the 1600 block of Arch Street in Little Rock. One gunshot wound to his neck. Ten years to the day and his father still wants answers. Daryl Hinton walks across the parking lot into the Pulaski County Sheriff's Office once more. It's still surreal to us. Talking with officials who privately gave him the latest update on his son, Sergeant First Class Jason Jackson, found shot in his car at a house for sale. Thursday marks 10 years to the day. It seemed like it just happened yesterday for us. We did develop early suspects or persons of interest early on in the investigation and to date, those, pe those persons are still uh, persons of interest. At this time, we have not uh, developed sufficient e evidence uh, for the prosecutor's office to uh, assess charges. Hinton's been down this road before, asking for someone to step forward who knows something about his son's murder. After every press conference through the years, he heads home to his wife, Penny. I actually thought I was uh, ready for this day, you know, but uh, I, I'm, I'm not. It's, it's still hard. It's still tough. I loved him. I love all my children, but, you know, individually, he was uh, special. Because he was such a great guy. And again, we appeal to anyone because someone knows. Someone knows. And we pray that you will please come forward then help us bring justice for Jason. 10 years is a long time. <clears throat> That's a long time. Any information on this unsolved case, please report it to the Pulaski Sheriff's Office. Reporting in Little Rock, Jay Jackson, THV 11 News.